Hi, this is Virgo the Oracle, and I'm here to do a reading for the sign of Virgo. Hey, guys. Let's tap into this energy like we always do. See if it changes, see if it stays the same. Spirit come through for Virgo. Hey, Virgo, how are you? Let's see what's going on. Spirit come through. Spirit come through. Mm -hmm. What messages do you have for Virgo? Virgo. Mm -hmm. Come through spirit. First position you have is Knight of Swords. Okay. The star. Mm -hmm. We have the Six of Cups. Okay. We have the Ace of Pentacles. Okay. We have the Ace of Swords in reverse. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We also have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. Mm -hmm. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe if this resonates. Hit that like button. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. We also have the Knight of Wands. Okay, we have the Three of Swords in reverse. We have the Seven of Cups reversed. We have the Two of Cups. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We have the Four of Pentacles reversed. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we have the Four of Wands reversed. Okay. Lordly, Lordly Spirit, what's happening here? Okay. All right, let's see what's going on. Mm-hmm. Give me this moment. Let me look this over. Mm, lots of reversals. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. Lots of reversals. Somebody has changed their mind here, huh? We have one major con of star card. We would definitely take it. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, you have the Will of Fortune. Things are getting better for you, Virgo. Things are changing for the better. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the Wheel of Fortune. You've been through a boatload of shit. Some of you feel like you would never get this love thing right. Every time you try to have a relationship, it's always some fuck shit. You, some of you feel like you have the worst luck in love. That's not the case. It's just you, you go through a lot of... You just you go through a lot of uh, learning lessons, okay? Especially when it comes to love, okay? Lots of learning lessons, all right? Don't beat yourself up. Don't think, you know, the universe is picking on you. Love is picking on you. How come I can't never find love or happiness and everybody else could? Not to worry. Things are definitely improving for you, okay? Not to worry, all right? You got the King of Pentacles. Who wants to come towards you? Somebody's coming towards you here. Uh-huh. Somebody wants to invest in you here, okay? You could be dealing with... um. A Capricorn, a Taurus, possibly another Virgo. Okay, somebody does want to invest in you. If they're not Earth energy, uh, they could be any sign, but they do want to invest in you or they wish they had or something like that. This person is thinking about you heavily, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. they judging themselves. Yeah, this is judgment. Somebody wants to do over with you. Mm -hmm. Somebody regrets their actions with you. Mm -hmm. They replan everything that they said, everything that they did. You stay in this person's mind quite often. They want to do it where they want to see if they can try again with you, okay? The happiness has been delayed ever since they screwed up with you, ever since they walked away from you, ever since you walked away from them. They just can't seem to find happiness. Everything is a delay for them, okay? Happiness is totally has been taken away from them since you walked away from them or since they walked away from you, however it went down. The happiness has been delayed, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They want to be happy, but they just can't. They just can't be without you, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person makes you do too much waiting. You've been waiting and waiting and waiting for this person. Let's see what else we got. Lordly, Lordly, come through spirit. Yeah, somebody wants to talk to you heavily. Somebody wants to talk to you in the worst way. They're rushing in to say something to you, okay? They're a little nervous, but they're going to get something off their chest. Uh, something that they want to say to you. They're a little apprehensive. This person is a little scared of you, a little nervous or something like that. But you already wish fulfillment. This person is wishing that they can see you again, wishing that they can talk to you again. Somebody wants communication with you again. You might have cut off all communication. You're not talking to them or... You're not seeing them uh, the way you're used to. This person is coming in for you, however you look at it. It's like they want something with you. They want to heal with you. They want to be with you. You make them feel better. You make them feel like a, like, you know, 
like they're loved or like they're seen or like you make them feel something, okay? Mm -hmm. Very familiar energy. You know this person for a long time. This is what they feel. They feel that familiarity, okay? They miss that. Uh huh. This person is coming in to tell you, tell you, they let you know that they want more with you. They want to offer you this Ace of Pentacles. This person wants to offer you more. They want a new, have some sort of new start, a new beginning. They want a, a new relationship. They want a new beginning. They want a fresh new start with you. Uh huh. But they don't. They didn't tell you. They don't tell you nothing. Okay. They they they. This is why they're rushing in to talk to you because they know they have to. They don't tell you nothing. They don't let you know how they feel. They don't let you know what's going on with them. This person absolutely tells you nothing. Okay? Mm -hmm. This it could have been no communication at all. Okay? With this ace of swords in reverse. Okay? You guys was together, but this person never told you how they feel. They never told you what they thought about. They never told you what was on their mind or something like that. And this ace of pentacles, this is why you left this person. Or this is why you no longer want to be bothered with this person. Lack of effort. Lack of focus. It could have been some sort of third party situation here because there was a distraction. You want more time. You want more effort from this person. Okay. That's what's needed for you to have something with this person. You need them to put a little bit more time and a little bit more effort in. Okay. From this person who wants to get it back in touch with you. Okay. And this person might be in and out back and forth, back and forth. We have the Knight of Wands. Fuck for your energy. No matter who you're here for, a boy or a girl, whoever you're here for, whoever you're dating, place it where it applies. Okay. This person is like very really indecisive. One moment they want it, next minute they don't. Okay. There's definitely somebody else that's in the picture here. Okay. Because this person goes back and forth, back and forth. You know, one minute they rushing in and then the next minute don't call them. Give them a minute. They shutting down. Okay. They need time. They need a space or some fuck shit like that. Okay. This is this one minute. This person is hot for you. Lots of passion for you. They might be like, you know, coming in for sex. And once they get it, they're gone. Okay. But it looks like you're healing and you're moving on from this. Okay. You you got the seven of cups in reverse. You're, you're no longer confused. There's no illusions here for you. You're starting to see this for exactly what it is. You done took the rose colored glasses off. Yeah. You think about them from time to time. You think about them a lot. You think about them just as much as they think about you. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're, we're not doubting that at all. You're just no longer refusing to hold on to this person. OK, many of you have accepted that this is a thing of the past. OK, now this person is ready to open up to you. OK, now they're being stubborn. Now they're being the one who won't take no for an answer. And you just see this for what this is. You know this person can't give you what you want. It's all or nothing for you. And this person just won't commit. This is a very non-committal energy, okay? Or well, this person can't commit to you, possibly because they're already in a third-party situation, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, you got somebody who wants to come back towards you, but they won't let go of their past. Okay, they want to come back towards you and have something with you, but they either have a long-term commitment or they already have a marriage, okay? That they won't let go. This person wants to hold on to you, okay? And you're already healing. You're already moving on. But they want to hold on to you, okay? They want you to wait for them. I don't know why they think this is possible. Who is this fool? Okay, this is somebody who's trying to hold on to you and think you're going to sit and wait, you know, count the days and count the nights and wait for them to decide who they want or what they want. Many of you have already healed and moved on. Okay, but you got this energy still trying to pull on you, still claiming that they want more with you. Okay, only, only to continue to not put enough effort in, to to not put enough focus on in on you. Okay, yeah. Somebody has too many distractions here. Somebody's interfering here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But this is somebody who's allowing the person to interfere. They're allowing this person to uh, distract you, to have distractions in this. Okay. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what we can get here, Virgo. Yeah, somebody was back into your life, Virgo. It's like you're too quiet or you're too happy. You have moved on. You're not paying them no mind anymore. Okay. Somebody's pissed off that they don't have you like they used to, Virgo. Okay. Yeah, somebody wants things just the way it used to be. Okay, we have the goddess of justice. Okay, what seems an injustice is actually a blessing. Okay, you might have felt that this person didn't treat you right. They didn't treat you fair. You know, they was never uh, on to up and up with you. They didn't show you no time. They didn't put no effort in. They didn't help you with nothing. Very frugal energy. They didn't help you with anything. You might have felt that this was just a one-sided 
limerous energy, okay? But what spirit is saying, what you thought was an injustice is actually a blessing, okay? A blessing in disguise. Get the lesson and move on, okay? We have angel of support. The universe has heard your silent cry for help, okay? Uh-huh. And this is what you're getting. You're feeling better. You're moving on. And every time you get strong and try to move on, this particular energy wants to show their head with you, okay? We have Goddess of the Unknown. A new chapter of your life is around the corner. Remove fear and embrace the unknown, okay? It's time to move on. Enough is enough and too much is good for nothing. You didn't gave this person too much of your time, okay? You didn't gave them too much of your energy. You have gave this person plenty of time to shit to get off the pot, okay? This person wants to play. This person still wants to do that cha-cha with you, okay? All right, we have an angel of new life, okay? An exciting new chapter in your life is a about to unfold. Yeah, you guys are already on the brink of something different. Okay, you're already on the brink of something new. All right, you might. Some of you might have, might have even met somebody new. Okay, this person can feel it. This person can sense it. However you look at it, you're not crying for this person anymore. You're not calling this person no more. You're not sweating them anymore. Okay, you have accepted the fact that this is the thing of the past, and now here come the past. Okay, we have angel of abundance. Okay, a steady flow of abundance is about to manifest for you. Okay, you guys is in a whole new different energy. You're not playing with this person anymore. Okay, actually, some of you are starting to feel sorry for this person. Mm, such kind hearts. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some of you actually feel a little sorry for them. Because you recognize that they're stuck in a situation. Okay. That they don't have enough guts or enough courage to get out of. Okay. Mm -hmm. Somebody got them good. That's why somebody manipulated this situation really good. They're under somebody's spell, whoever this is. Okay. All right. We have inner darkness. Hold safe space, okay? Knowing patterns, release versus feed. Look at that. Mm -hmm. This person is in their own little inner darkness right now. They thought they, they can come to you and you can heal them. You can share your light with them, okay? Uh -huh. They delay their own happiness, okay? Because when they come to you is they get, they get their, they get, they get that energy check from you or, you know, they come and feel better. You heal them with your words or, or with your energy or something like that. And then they go right back to where they come from. Only to be running right back to you shortly after that, okay? This person has their own demons to... uh to fight stay out of it stop trying to help them okay we got feel emotions okay understand emotions inner guidance and validate self aye, aye, aye. okay so you guys do feel their emotions you feel this energy you feel this person's sadness you feel them wanting you or something it makes you want to help them it, make, it makes you you know want to be there for them okay but spirit is asking you to be still okay you have stillness okay calm the mind overthink and observe awareness yeah you want to reach out to this person you want to be there for this person when this person comes back towards you but person is saying be still let them handle their own drama they got themselves in it okay they got themselves in it they run to you just to feel better and then when you make them feel better when you heal them they go right back and take that energy right back to that that she wolf or that he wolf that they're with okay Okay, we have ego illusions, okay? Don't believe thoughts, inner stories, and befriend ego, okay? Mm, ego illusions. Don't believe thoughts, inner thoughts, and befriend ego. Mm. Okay, some of you are not even believing your own intuition here, okay? Some of you are not listening to it because your ego won't let you, okay? Some some of you know that this person don't mean you no good, but, you know, you're just fighting against it because you want what you want what you want, okay? Set that ego and that pride and that ego aside, okay? See, this for what this is. Stop letting people use you, okay? All right? Don't pay attention to those illusions that it is, 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 is what this person is saying. It is what I want it to be when you know it's not, okay? Mm -hmm. Raise your vibration if you know you're in that energy, okay? Connect to the light. Release blocks, strength, and safety. Strengthen and safety. You are getting strong, okay? You are getting strong, Virgo. This is why this person is coming at you. Whenever you get strong, this person comes in for you, okay? Uh-huh. We have divine timing. Trust the universe. Follow the flow. Patience and signs. You guys see the signs. You feel the signs, okay? You've been very patient with this person. Very patient, okay? Only to keep getting disappointed. Only to keep getting your feelings hurt or 
keep getting um, bamboozled, tricked, led astray, lied to, deceived. Enough of that, okay? Enough of that. Okay? It's only giving you an attitude. It's only making you matter. Okay? See this for what this is with this person. Spirit, can I have some more messages for Virgo, please? See this for what this is. Okay. Spirit, come through. Mm -hmm. I ghosted you because I was getting too intense. I ghosted you because it was getting too intense. I don't like people in my life easy. I don't let people in my life easily because I have trust issues. Lordly, lordly. Ain't nobody got time. Okay, some of you got to deal with somebody that needs to grow up. Okay. This person thinks somebody's out to get them, okay? But they better be careful what they do to other people, okay? I'm going through a lot right now. I need space and time to gather my thoughts. This person might have even told you that, okay? This person might have ghosted you and sent you a long text after days of not hearing from them saying some bullshit like that, okay? I can't stop thinking about you. I'm seeing the synchronicities. is driving me crazy, okay? Whatever they said to you, the spirit is kicking their behind. Uh huh. Karma is kicking their behind. This is why this person is going to be rushing back in towards you, okay? Because they're, they're delaying their own happiness. We have unclear path. Step by step, keep going. And it will lead you to destina it will lead you to destinations that might not have that you might have not considered. Unknown. Hidden blessings. Okay? Mm -hmm, mm hmm Unclear path. Look at that. It's time to unclear your path. All right. You've been going through some fuck shit with this person. This has been a thorn in your side. Lord, Lee, Lord, Lord. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. We got hidden secrets, careful of superficial appearances. Or making decisions without all facts. Act with discernment, okay? Unse unseen, sly approach, and careful. Okay? This person might try to outsmart you. They might think they're, they're smarter than you. They might try to out outwit you or something like that. Okay? Don't fall for the okie doke, okay? You know what you know what you know. We have celebration. This is a great time in your life. Things are progressing with grace and ease as never before. Triumph, parties, and fun times. Okay? Now, you're doing real good right now. Your energy is thriving. Your, uh, your life is thriving. Everything is doing very good. Going very good for you right now. Don't let this energy come back and disturb your peace. Uh-uh, you fight back, okay? I miss making love to you. I would do anything just to hold you again, okay? Yeah. This person is definitely coming back to try to woo you again, try to get back in your good graces, okay? Uh-huh. Some of you are going to let this person back in because you're going to keep going through it until you get it. Some of you let this person in and then you'll be regretting it as soon as you do, okay? Here we come through. Ah, this explains it all. Some of you guys are twin flames, okay? For some of you, this is your twin. This is why you tolerate so much from this person. Anybody else, you would have been kicked them to the curb, okay? But there's an imbalance between you and your twin, okay? There is an unequal power dynamic in a situation that needs to be brought back to balance. Okay, right now it's unequal, it's unfair, it's a, it's a bunch of conflict, Okay, somebody's not seeing your worth or somebody's not treating you accordingly or something like that. Okay, many of you are tolerating too much disrespect from this person. Okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we have next level. Okay, if you leave your comfort zone, you will see accelerated growth and change, expansion, explore, growth. Okay, uh huh. We have creative forces. Okay, your creativity is endless. The creative power that you hold with is far greater than you than you realize okay this the creative power you hold within is far greater than you realize artists inspiration innovative some of you are very good at decorating okay putting clothes together designing clothes painting okay you're very good with the colors you're very good with putting things together and making a masterpiece very talented people very very gifted Let's see what else we have, Spirit. Okay, we have walking unscathed. Okay, you are fortunate. A trap was laid out for you, but you were too smart to fall for it. Protected, undamaged, safe. Some of you have already be beat this person to their own game. <laughs> Some of you have already beat this person with, with their own stick. 
Shit, you had already beat them at their own game. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Somebody thought it was easy. Somebody thought it was going to be easy to pull a wool over your eyes. Uh-huh. Truth is, I'm in love with you. Lord have mercy. This I'm not going to say this person don't love you. This person very much might love the ground you walk on. They just don't know what to do with you. Uh-huh. They wasn't expecting to fall in love with you. They wasn't expecting to fall for you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So now what they going to do with the other one? Mm-hmm. They, they have invested so much in, okay? We got a fresh start, okay? This new chapter will require you to step. This new, this new chapter will require you to take a leap of faith in the process in which is in front of you. New beginnings, new possibilities. Lord, you guys are being offered a new opportunity. Uh -huh. New way of living, new life. You're, you're being offered something amazing, okay? Something new is coming in for you. you something is coming full circle for you guys, okay? Uh-huh. And it looks like you're gonna take it up. Mm-hmm. You're not you're no longer waiting and waiting and playing these, you know, mind games with somebody. It's all or nothing for you. It's all or nothing. You feel like if you ain't coming with the all, don't come at all. All or nothing. Mm-hmm. That's how you feel. You said all or nothing don't get the stepping. You said ain't nobody got time. Yeah, it's all or nothing for you. Mm-hmm. This person is very curious about you now. You done got too quiet. Okay? You're not falling for the okie duck. You're not calling them. You're hungry. Trying to fix them breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Or chasing them down like you used to. You're not doing any of that. Stroking, that they, stroking their ego the way you used to. Somebody's very curious about you now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're going to start forcing their way into your life again. Forcing things on you. Forcing their way in. Using force to get what they want. This is going to be hilarious. <laughs> When you see this person throwing a whole tantrum because you ain't paying no mind no more. Okay? Mm hmm This person ain't shit. Lord have mercy. Now, that's not me saying it, guys. That's the cards. You know, it's the cards don't lie. I keep telling y'all. The cards don't lie. Mm, 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 mm. Lord have mercy. What y'all dealing with? Okay, whatever they're dealing with, you're not interested anymore. We got uninterested. This person done burned their bridges. Look at her face. She is over it. Done. This person don't even look the same to you no more. You don't even feel the same. Uh-uh. Some of you wanted this person so bad, you just wanted to win. Okay, you just wanted to get your way. You don't even like this person no more. Check yourself, okay? You don't even really want this person. You thought you did. Uh-huh. They're going to look funny looking next time you see them, okay? We have fake flexing. Lord, this person don't This person don't have what you think they have, okay? They act rich, fall, floss, money, act fancy, shows off, etc., okay? Yeah, they might have needed you to keep them up, okay? This person might have needed your energy, okay? Because you was too busy winning, all right? Somebody wants to jump on the bandwagon with you, okay? You might have been the one who made this person glow, okay? We also got a spiritual hater. Hates on your spirituality, your light, your magic, and your power. This person might hate your energy because of that light worker energy, okay? They might hate your confidence, okay? They might hate how spirit blesses you. How you don't have to work so hard to get stuff. You know, some people got to work two, three jobs to get something. Okay, you don't have to do that. Something like that, okay? Mm -hmm. There's a thief around. Be careful, okay? Don't let nobody come and steal a goddamn thing from you, okay? Steal your time. Steal your love. Steal your mind. Steal your peace, okay? It don't always have to be money. It could, but on this card is money. So be careful. Don't let nobody take nothing from you. Okay. We have photo proof getting the evidence. Okay. All right. If you're just, if you're messing with somebody that got somebody else, be careful. They could be taking pictures on y'all or watching y'all or following your person or following you. Okay. Be very careful. Yeah. Scarcity scarcity tactics. Okay. Mm hmm Yeah. Some of y'all dealing with somebody that got a complete nut on their hands. They can't be with you because they done already got involved in something they can't get the hell out of. Okay? They can't get out of. Whoever they're with is not letting them go. 
Okay, whoever they're with and unhappy with, that person ain't letting them go. Let them stay there with them. They chose it. You made your bed, lay in it. Okay. Whoever they with has a bad reput reputation. Okay. This person is nothing nice. This person has a bad reputation. Real prickly. Okay. Real thorny. Uh huh. Yeah, we got haunted memories, flashbacks, trauma, side effects. This person is haunted by your actions, so haunted by your energy. This person wants more of you. They're not getting you. Some of you to cut this person completely off. Now they're going cold turkey. It's not easy for them to walk away from you. It's not easy for them to be without you. Okay, even if they had you somewhere waiting for them or something like that. And to you, this has become completely played out. You're just no longer interested. This is corny to you now. Some of you are beating yourself up like, I can't believe I put up with this shit this long, okay? Yeah, you were really into this person. You felt they had good chemistry. The vibes was good. They was positive. You was really into this person, okay? You feel tricked by this person or, or betrayed or bamboozled or something like that, okay? You, you, low IQ. Now you think the person is dumb or stupid or something like that? Lordly, lordly. Your hands down realizing that you dodged some sort of bullet here, okay? Yeah. Hands down, that's how you feel. I dodged a bullet. Blocking negativity, escaping crazy ass people, protected by the haters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all that. That was you. Mm -hmm. That was you, all that right there. Mm -hmm. Spirit, can I have one more deck, please? Spirit, will come through. For Virgo. Okay, we got porn addiction. Mm, somebody likes to watch people have sex. Okay, porn sites. Mm -hmm. Only fan subscription, sexual dysfunction. Okay, this person might be having trouble with their penis. Uh huh. Highs the obsession and lies when caught. Okay, you might be dealing with somebody with some sort of obsession, some sort of sex addiction, or something like that. We also got sex, sexual ties, okay? Mutual cravings for each other, mind-blowing sex, sex addiction. You both might have some sort of a sex addiction. It could be the sex that pull you both in together, okay? This might be a very high sexual attraction with this person, okay? Okay, we have game addiction. Good Lord, y'all dealing with somebody that play video games? Okay, for some of you. Okay, using video games to escape, making and losing money on games, ignoring priorities. Okay, you might be dealing with somebody that's very juvenile, very immature. Okay, spends a lot of time on the game, don't see you, ignore you. Somebody needs to grow up. Okay. Mm -hmm. We got a dangerous obsession. Use caution. Mentally unstable. Locked in on you. Oh, my goodness. This person is not going to take no for an answer. Okay? It's not going to be easy to get away from this person. Especially if you stood around tolerating this shit for so long. Okay? Mm. Yeah. If it gets that bad, get a protection order. Okay? Get away from this person. Yeah, we got online obsession. This person might follow you online or watch you online. Online fan is obsessed. Looking you up. Personal information, sending you mail, Lord have mercy. That's a creepola. That's a weirdo right there, okay? Very sneaky, sneaky link, third party involved, non-committal. Doesn't want to choose. This person don't want to make a choice, all right? This person, this person don't want to make a choice between you and the person that they have, okay? They might spend a lot of time online. They might got cameras watching you or something like that. Somebody spends too much time online. Game addiction online. Mm. We got alcohol binge, drowning in pain, alcoholic tendencies, ignoring the problem. Who the hell drinks like that? Somebody drinking their pain away? Uh huh. Somebody stay drunk. Okay. Mm -hmm. Booty shots. Okay, I don't know why this came out. Dangerous BBL and booty injections. All about their looks, body insecurity. Okay. All right. All right, somebody is really big on their looks, okay? Enhancing their ass, their boobs, taking fat out their waistline, okay? Somebody is just all into their looks, okay? Okay, we got deceitful energy, okay? Selling false dreams, okay? Long string of lies, selfish motives, ooh. 
Somebody might be spending a lot of money, okay? Um, you know, enhancing their body, making them look more sexual, sexually attractive to the opposite sex. When the opposite sex don't care at all, it's just something they want to do, okay? We got holding back. Holding back the truth, block, throat, chakra. This person can't even tell you what's going on. They might be with somebody that's spending a lot of money. Okay? On their shit. And lying about it, too. You see that Pocinocchio nose? They're lying about it. But this person is not going to tell you. They're too embarrassed. Okay? We have a scorn ex. Okay? Their ex is not over them. Watching everything. Obsessed with you and them. Okay? That could be somebody that's online watching, too. It could be their ex watching you. Okay? Driving past your house, going past your job, okay, making up fake accounts to try to communicate with you or some shit like that. Be very mindful of this, all right? We got playing a role, not living their truth, fake promises, living a lie. Lord have mercy. You know, you got to keep in mind, some people will go above and beyond the call of duty to act a fool. Know that. Know that. Nothing surprises me. And a damn sure it shouldn't surprise you, Okay. Okay, we got in custody, in and out of prison, jail, street mentality, dangerous, manipulative tendencies, okay? All right, this person might be in jail, okay? This person might be writing you and calling you and writing somebody else and calling them. You both might go see this person at the same time. One of them ain't going to be able to get in, okay? We got bad boy person persona, okay? Street smarts, addictive personality, low vibration. Why do good girls like bad guys, okay? Some of you are dealing with somebody you have no business dealing with, okay? All right? All right? You date according to your self-esteem, so make sure you raise that vibration. I hope you guys enjoyed this read. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Talk to you soon. I should.